Okay, um, this is, this video that I'm doing is going to be kind of different because I just bought this gas mask and, um, I'm going to do a kind of like a review type of thing. Uh, okay, the gas mask I have here is called a M15 Israel gas mask. It's the gas mask they use over in Israel. Uh, it comes with a standard 40 millimeter NATO filter that you can use and a uh, drinking straw that hooks into the gas mask. Now, this gas mask will protect you from a lot of shit, like, um, it'll protect you from NBC, which means nuclear, uh, biological, and chemical. It's a very nice gas mask. It's very comfortable. When you put on the gas mask, you can, uh, it's very lightweight. You can't really tell what's going on. When you breathe in the gas mask, you uh, breathe in from this little hole right here, and it comes out of this little knob thing. So when you inhale, it goes in that, that way, and then it comes out like that. Now, I just, I did some research on this gas mask, and uh, I found that I think this NATO canister, I think it's expired, because I looked at the serial number, and it says 95 on it, it's 2008 right now, I'm like, oh, dude, I'm like, oh, shit. And I breathed some of that shit in, too. But I'm fine, I only breathed it in for like a minute, just to test it out, but now I know. Okay, if you're going to buy this gas mask, then buy new NBC canisters, okay? You don't want to risk uh, dying because this thing's expired or whatever. Um, to install the... Uh, tube thing. You have to unscrew this little part on the gas mask. It comes out like that. And, uh, and you just, and it's threaded, so you can use, like, almost any type of tube that has the same type of thread. And you just screw that in like that, and once that's in, uh, there's a little tube inside the mask. You can't really see it, but, uh, it's right there and you drink from that tube. And I think it's pretty pretty uh, good for a gas mask. I mean, I don't know a lot about gas masks. I just got into them. Um, uh, let's see. Um, if you are going to buy a gas mask, this is actually a pretty good find. I bought this gas mask off of eBay for um, 40 bucks, and uh, most other websites I've seen for like 80 and one one other website sell for 190. So if you buy it off the of eBay, it's a pretty good deal. And like I said, get a new canister. It's, if you buy an expired canister and you breathe it in, it's not going to kill you, but it could really hurt you bad. Like I don't know. Um, it has like some kind of um, bad type of chemical in it or something in the expired canister. So don't use these types uh, if it's expired over 10 years. Remember, 10 years. If it's more than 10 years old, then don't use it. And, um, that's about it. I I didn't really buy this gas mask for seriousness. Um, it's just really, I just used it for airsoft. And, uh, and just for looks. And when you put on the gas mask, like I said, it's really comfortable. You do get a little bit sweaty. All your breathing goes through this little, um, respirator thing. It has like a built-in voice box, so uh, so yeah, you don't have to worry about fog with the gl with the glass or plastic lenses. And that's about it. It's a very nice gas mask. I would suggest it to anybody who's worried about terrorists and shit. I don't know. And uh, I don't know. It's a pretty nice gas mask. And that's all I have to say. Really well worth the money here. I'll try to. Get it in better light. Sorry, this camera sucks ass, I know. That's what it looks like. It's very easy to adjust. And it's got the built-in water thing where you can drink from it. It's pretty cool. Alright. It's called an F-15 gas mask. So remember that kind of brand. And it's what the Israel civilians use. Alright, peace.